Hey guys, I'm Marley and welcome back to my channel. I recently took a trip up to San Jose with my boyfriend. At first we only wanted to go because we were in the mood for Korean barbecue and we just wanted to like satisfy that craving. But then I was thinking that there's also got to be like a ton of Korean beauty stores around there too. So I did a quick Google search and a few things actually popped up. I went to the Aritom, the Face Shop, and the Dezo and a Paris baguette, but that's besides the point. I went a little bit crazy, so just bear with me. As you can tell, this bag is just like, it's like overstuffed, it's crumpling. So the first thing that I got and I had my eyes on as soon as I stepped into the store was the BAM Laneige set. I had to have this. I actually didn't even mean to get this full set. I purchased these two products separately and the woman was so nice and was like, oh no, wait, you get you get a whole thing. So I was like, oh my God, thank you. I got the uh, Skin Renew uh, Skin Refiner, essentially. It's like a toner, pretty much, like a gel kind of a toner. This one I bought is the Perfect Renew Emulsion. And since I bought those two things, she was super nice and threw in these. Uh, this is the Perfect Renew Eye Cream. This one is the Perfect Renew Regenerator. And then this one is the Perfect Renew Cream, like a heavier moisturizer, so a lot thicker than this one. So yeah, that was awesome that just because I bought these two things for, I wanna say about 26 bucks a piece that I got the entire set. So the next product that I got was one that I specifically went in the store for. I knew it was probably gonna be on the pricier, End, but I didn't really care. I just wanted this product so badly. I've been dying to try it. It is the Most people know this orange packaging. It is the Sulwasu Overnight Vitalizing Mask. I have been dying to try this for the longest time. If you don't know about Sulwasu, they are an incredible brand. They are definitely on the higher end like luxury side so their stuff is not cheap I want to say that I paid around $56 for this guy so like I said I'm pretty sure that you can get it online for a lot cheaper so don't don't pay what I paid don't do that it's a sleeping pack you put it on after you've done all your other fun stuff and skincare routine and you wake up and you just are a unicorn so all right, and then I feel like I need to bring these next two items out together because they're kind of like a little yin and a yang set here. I got the water sleeping mask and the multi berry yogurt repairing mask. So I got these two little cuties here. Uh, they are about the same price. The Laneige Multi Berry Yogurt Repairing Mask I hear is absolutely phenomenal in terms of irritation or breakouts. You do it in the middle of your routine, it's more of a wash off kind of a mask. And then this one I have tried, I didn't try the other one, but I have tried this one once already. And it is the Laneige Water Sleeping Mask. This one is intense hydration, so if you feel like you have any dry patches at all, you would put this on last in your routine. Uh, go to sleep and I especially love sleeping masks too because I am super lazy So it is just like the easiest thing no effort literally just go to sleep. That's it All right next up because that's of course I couldn't control myself and you know That's not all that I purchased. I also saw that the store had a huge selection of RYO products they have the anti-aging and the moisturizing line, like literally everything. But I had never tried any of the products. I had just heard really good stuff about them before. So I wanted to just try one thing and see how it was. This one is the Total Anti-Aging Rinse for dry hair. You guys can take a look at that. You get a ton of product in here. I mean, this thing is like pretty huge. I'm not gonna lie, mostly what got me was the anti-aging rinse. Maybe that'll mean like my hair won't fall out when I'm older or something. But either way, I am super excited to try this one and I'll definitely let you guys know how this is. Now that was all the stuff that I purchased uh, from the store itself. And the rest of this in here now is just all samples that she was so awesome and nice enough to give me. So the first thing that I was really surprised that she threw in was like a full, products worth of uh, soap berry brightening cleansing tissue from Happy Bath. I had never heard of 
Oh, there you go. I had never heard of Happy Bath before. I checked out their Instagram page though, and they tend to make a lot of cleansers and you know, face wash products and everything. So it seemed interesting, but yeah. So I thought that was pretty awesome that she threw in like an entire packet of face wipes. So thank you, nice lady. The next two free items she gave me were super generous because I was eyeing these anyways, and I steered myself away. I was like, no, you are not getting that. You do not need any more face masks. So the fact that she just threw these in, she gave me two bio-intensive essence facial masks from Io. Kind of check that out. These were very pricey. I want to say that they were over five bucks. Uh, that's what kind of made me not want to get it. I was like, oh, I should be good and not. So the fact that she threw in two was so dope. And I was like double excited just because um, they did carry a ton of IO stuff, but I just didn't get it. I did not have enough money to get anything out of the IO collection as well. So the fact that I can try two masks from them is so great. And then the last thing that she gave me for free that I was the most shocked at probably was the Sul Wasu Radiance Energy Mask. This is a mini version of it. It sells for like 86 bucks. Apply and spread an appropriate amount over your face and let it absorb. Leave it overnight and wash off with cleanser the next morning. Cool, I am so excited to try this one. This is probably like the best free thing she threw in. But that was everything that I got from Ari Town. I spent overall, I literally, now that I'm looking, I threw the receipt away because that's how like ashamed I was that day. But I remember I spent about 200 bucks. Don't don't hit me, please don't hit me. And now lastly, I will go through and show you guys what I got from the face shop. I would have done a haul as well for the Dezo, but unfortunately, I was just so eager with most of that stuff and a lot of it was snacks that I already ate half of it or broke into half of it or drank most of it. So, sorry, it's already gone. I threw away the face shop bag that it came in because it was literally bursting at the seams. That's how much stuff I got. So I put in this cute little Lush bag instead, so. Don't be distracted. So the first thing that I'll show you guys that I got from the face shop, I was most excited about this guy here. I've read a lot about cleansing oils and I've been wanting to try one for a while. I don't have one in my skincare line. So I bought this. It is the Real Blend Calming Cleansing Oil. There was three of these. I was stuck between all of them. One is like a deep rich, one is like an original, and this one is calming. So they all have, if you guys can see, there's like little bits of lavender floating around in this one and it's all real lavender floating around in the oil. The other ones had, I'm not sure exactly what, but they had other flowers floating around in them. So next up is the one that I'm a little confused about because they were essentially running a huge deal where it was uh, buy 10 masks, get 12 free. So I was like, all right, sweet, that's great. And I wanna say that the masks were like $3 a piece, but tell me how I ended up spending $86 on like a ton of masks and yeah, no, just yeah, yeah, masks. Cause I'm like digging and there's literally just masks. Some of them are lip masks, but they're masks. So tell me how I spent like $80 at that store. I'm not gonna go through and show you guys every mask because literally that would take 60 years. So I'm just gonna tell you guys uh, for the most part, they were all kind of the same too. I got like groups of the same thing. Oh, and by the way, the deal was all for like secret nature for the most part. And I do like secret nature, so that's why I was so excited. This one is the aloe mask sheet. I love them for soothing. Uh, they're great when you have blemishes or burns or you go too hard on washing your face like I do. No, nobody else does that. No, okay. Also, I got secret nature nourishing coconut mask sheet. I got blueberry mask sheet. Oh, firming, firming blueberry mask sheet. That's what that does. Uh, brightening lemon mask sheet. Got two of those as well. Uh, moisturizing rose mask sheet. Got two of these. I'll admit I was completely ignorant. It looks like a superfood of some kind, kind of like a kidney bean. I don't know. Uh, Lingzi, Lingzi, Lingzi. Yeah, it's for my face, I'm excited. Uh, Longan, another berry which I've never in my life heard of. I don't know if you guys have had. I got a few of the Lotus as well. 
uh, a bunch of the green teas just because those are so great to have on hand when your skin is a little irritated and you just kind of need something soothing and calming. It's perfect. Um, I, I'm just throwing these masks, just throwing masks, throwing masks. Red ginseng, I do know what that is. It's great. I love it when they incorporate it into serums and masks. And last, I got the goji berry ones. Those are great. I'm excited to try them. Super cute. And then I got two random little guys here. This one is the Jeju Horse Oil Mask Pack. This one says effective in whitening and anti-aging. So yeah. And then I got the Solution Vitamin C Radiance Face Mask formulated with vitamin C. So the last little things in here, I also still paid for these, not free. I bought one of the Modeling Gel Patch Lip Masks things from the Fay shop. I've never tried their brand before, so it looked really interesting. This one's got a really interesting texture to it. It's like super jelly, almost like watery, like it's filled with fluid. Oh, that's so weird. So that'll be fun to try. I'm excited to try that. And then lastly, I got this other uh, lip mask, BB lip mask. And you can't really tell what that is, but the packaging was super cute. It sucked me in. It won, I lost, and it's whatever. Oh, no, I paid for these. I paid for these, this wasn't even free. God, it was like a dollar, but still. My boyfriend wanted some like pore strips for his nose, so I figured we would try out the Jeju Volcanic Lava Volcanic Ash Nose Strips. I got two of those, they look great, super fun. It'll be a spa day. So that was everything that I purchased from the store. So like I said, tell me again how I spent like 80 bucks, man. I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna shove that shove it and suppress it shove it and suppress it it's fine it's fine so everything else that's left in the bag here are samples that she was kind enough to give me that she damn well should have gave me because i spent 80 dollars actually i got two little vials here from Dr. Belmure. I have heard of this brand. I've never gotten to try anything from it. They did carry a lot um, of that brand. That is the outside packaging. You guys can see that. Everything else that she gave me in terms of samples is all from the Dr. Belmure line. This is like a foam cleanser and a foam cleanser and a moisturizer and a salt cream. The fuck is a salt cream? And the last one here is from the face shop, a uh, Verbinia Soothing Body Cleanser. But yeah, that is everything that I had for you guys today. That is everything that I purchased, thank God, because if I had purchased any more, I would literally be living in the box that these items came in. And definitely let me know in the comment section down below if you guys have uh, purchase any of this stuff yourself or if you've tried it before uh, I'd love to know what you think of it and I love hearing feedback from you guys if you guys did like this video please be sure to hit that subscribe button up top so you can see more videos like this in the future thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you next time bye